Good morning to all you drafting degenerates. It's time for week three. I'm playing Bone. We're playing it a bit. I'm gonna show you the team. Um, so Bone's got the snow team. Uh, he's two and zero, oh, which is very impressive. Uh, I mean, the team actually is very, also pretty good. Like, it's got strong special attackers. It's got st uh, enough strong physical attackers that you kind of have to take it seriously. Um, Iron Bundle is stupid fast. Uh, Slow King's a pretty great trick room setter. Hasn't brought Diplin yet. Uh, he might, because like, I don't have a great ice-type attacker, but uh, also I think... He's just got better Pokemon to bring, so I'm not that worried about Diplin for the week. Um, but my goal is to kind of take advantage of this snow a little bit uh, and bring what would be a pretty rough Pokemon into the matchup, Torterra, and use Terra Ice to turn it into a pretty good one. Um, so... Here's the team we're bringing. Tinkaton is again, I think, going to be important. Um, steel hits like everything. Uh, rock is good into stuff. Knock off is nice. Fake out, obviously awesome. Shookaberry, um, of the two weaknesses that Tinkaton has to fire and ground, uh, I think ground, uh, ground coverage is much more likely. So if I can turn like a beefy two hit into a like maybe I live a three hit or something like that or you know just a stomping tantrum becomes three hits instead of two hits or I live a Baxcalibur earthquake instead of not living a Baxcalibur earthquake um, I think the sugar bear is gonna be nice um, probably an aqua Tauros also it's gonna be pretty good um, Fighting, water, and ground are all strong, neutral, or better options. Into the team, uh, and we're going with the Sash to uh, protect against, um, like, Articuno, uh, strong flying type attack, uh, if I'm not Terraing. Uh, Terra Dark is a pretty good Terra type. I almost brought Terra Moltres with Terra Dark. Um, as one of my six, but we're going with uh, with this six and set. Um, we've got the Typhlosion, Flamethrower, and Eruption, uh, Shadow Ball for coverage. There's no Ghost uh, resists on the team, and so Shadow Ball is good neutral, and then uh, Fire for basically everything else. We got a Charcoal for that reason. So basically, I was going to be clicking. Um, fire move almost all the time um these two at max speed are speed tied but that's okay because pheasantipity is 99 speed so i'm outspeeding the pheasantipity by one um that's a pretty obvious speed calc so i don't necessarily know that bohm is actually going to max speed the pheasantipity just to then get outsped by one by two pokemon that can do that can either you know oko it or or do good damage into it um, but man, I would just feel so stupid if it was, uh, if it was max speed and I didn't max speed my two mods that could outspeed it by one and, uh, I lost as a result. That would be pretty terrible. Um, we're going to imprison the, sh the trick room this week. Uh, I'm not instructing, um, just got, uh, you know, we've got the imprison, we've got tr the trick room there and then. Uh, we're going to just get some damage with the uh, with the Orangaroo. Um, Instruct might still just be better, but uh, I'm gonna go with the uh, with the two two attacking moves. Um, then we've got uh, Rotom Fan coming back from week one. Uh, it's Choice Scarf with Trick just as a little extra. Um, trick room insurance. Um, this is outspeeding max 
uh, max speed iron bundle that doesn't get a like that gets a special attack boost from court drive so it's like it's like 188 i think 189 something like that um so i think it's possible that bohm booster spatacks this week uh because he can be faster than my persian with and and still get a modest like and still be modest and get that uh damage boost so i'm scarfing to outspeed that speed number uh and then this thunderbolt will kill it uh volt switch actually is a roll to kill it so uh volt switch plus something else next to it maybe fake out we can uh we can kill it that way but yeah the thunderbolt will kill an iron bundle as long as rotom fan can move first uh and then my fourth mod here we've got assault vest torterra uh, which actually lives a, um, a it lives a timid uh, freeze dry from um, 252 special attack um, bundle and then you know is a chance to kill it with seed bomb but uh, plus any other attack it will kill it it's like 88 percent minimum or something like that like 104. Uh, max uh but if i terra ice then uh like nothing kills this thing uh it's become super 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 bulky um the assault vest is then also uh handling the special side pretty well and we've got you know four good attacking moves that we can switch between as needed um ground grass rock and steel um, that is the team overall. We're playing in 40 minutes or so. Um, and we'll see how it goes. Hopefully good. I'd love to keep winning. Um, anyway, peace. Alrighty, it's battle in time. Set the challenge. Best of three. All right, I'll zoom out one so there's no overlap stuff. Okay, so what do we got? We got the Pheasantipity. Who do we not have? We have no Chef. We have no Diplin, Chargebug, Lolan, Santa Slash, Whiskash. So it's Chargebug, Santa Slash, Whiskash. Yes. Bop, 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 bop. Yep. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, Taurus looks great here still. Uh, Tank a ton still looks great. This is the only fire resist is nice. Four water resists. Water, grass, dragon, water. But, um... I think my four is going to be one, two, uh, actually one, and Rotom Fan is my second, because uh, this will let me know right away, well, presuming the, the bundle is in the lead, um, who's faster. Well, actually, I might not even need to do that. I might be able to just fake out plus Volt Switch, um, Typhlosion, and Tauros. Seems pretty good. Torterra also seems pretty good, but really wants to Terra. It's right there in the name. Um... We'll go with Taurus as my fourth. Bax and Pheasantipity. Alrighty. Um, this is like... So how do I want to do this? Um, I 
probably want to volt switch out into the Tauros here. And then do I want to fake something out? Or do I want to like knock off or just gigaton hammer the back's caliber? Um, I think I just want to gigaton hammer the back's caliber and volt switch, split it up. Water, yeah. Everybody always should have should have targeted it. Oh well. Uh, we're still gonna get a minus one, and then yeah, everybody tear water. Dragon dance. Oh, and it's uh, clear amulet. Um, okay, so how do we want this to go? So they're gonna tailwind go first. Um, yeah, fake out might have been the smarter play, but that's okay. Um, what if we knock off and protect here? Yeah, Shuka, yeah, that one. You still live, nice. Knock off. Bax is down to 50. Um, zoom out a little more so I've got my bottom guys here. Um, bring the Rotom fan back into this slot. That way I can fake out again. And this was what? D-Gleam? Haha, <laughs> didn't expect the Shuka. Nobody does. Uh, but it's very good. Um, and then high horsepower into the Pheasantipity. Sure. Yeah, heat wave does nothing. Oh, it doesn't do nothing. Burn. Oh my goodness. Got both. That's brutal. Um, so Scarf. So this is Tailwind and plus one speed. So <laughs> there's no way uh, Rotom is faster. Uh, I think if I Volt Switch and Protect, <coughs> this seems pretty safe. Uh, maybe not. It does have a nice move also, doesn't it? Uh, but now I can bring this in, I can fake out the backs, and should be able to finish off the, um, <clears throat> Pheasantipity here. Slow King comes in. Okay, sure. Uh, don't love that, but it's not the end of the world. I do still have a Terra, uh, Terra Ghost is nice here. Um, so Bax can't kill, Bax was stomping tantrum, right? Yeah. So Bax can't kill both. I can knock off and I don't have a good way to hit this slow king with the Tauros. I can tear a ghost, the Typhlosion, but this feels like we're going to a game two this point. Of course I said that last time and then ended up winning that game two versus Braff. That was I'm still that was crazy. That was a crazy game. Um backs protected. Uh do I want to just get some damage? Yeah this that burn. The heat wave burn plus the toxic burn on the Wrote him. That was rough. Um, I'm not sure what the play is here. I don't want to switch in the Typhlosion. Do I? Maybe I do, actually. I'm not going to put a water attack here or a stomping tantrum. I 
Maybe I do actually. Oh, Bohm's brain is so big. Oh uh, man, well done to Bohm. What a call. What a call. Um, okay, so now we Terra Dark and we what just high horsepower or something? I don't know, I have no good attacks, it's burned. Uh, I got smoked in this first game. Um, I don't want to show my Terra actually. Yeah, I'm just not going to show my Terra. There's there's no need to. And uh, let me just do it again. Yeah. All right, GG. Alrighty, so I'm ready for game two. What is the plan for game two? So the, did we figure out what the item was on the Pheasantipity? No. Um, let's upload before the, uh, servers crash again and we lose all replays. It's not copying for some reason, that's weird. Open up a new tab then. Um, alrighty, and so what have we got here? Same Z's. Um, so the Tinkaton. Rotom fan lead is not terrible. Um, actually, what if it's Rotom Tauros? Uh, and I double into the Pheasantipity, or I can, you know, Volt Switch out if it's something else or whatever. Um, and I think. Snow is more likely to come, so I think I want the Torterra and the Typhlosion as my fourth, or do I want Tinkaton? I want Tinkaton. Okay, so we learn if. Okay, so it is booster speed. Uh, which means I can Thunderbolt and I can oh actually I, I think I want to volt switch it and protect Ghost, sure, okay. Big damage, although ghost means I can't fake it out, uh, but still bringing in the Tinkaton seems pretty decent. And then Obama Snow, Aurora Veils, yeah. Um, I can knock off and Raging Bull. I do have the Sash. So I can break the screens and just get some chip. So Freeze Dry takes me down to Sash. Oh, Encore. Well done. Doesn't even kill it. I guess no, no item, but still. Dang. Ugh, I even thought about running Lumberry to deal with potential freezes, but um, that seemed 
a little too suspect. Um, okay, so I'm gonna switch in the Rotom fan here, or no, I can't just play 2v1 for five turns or whatever, or three turns until this encore is over. But I can't just do nothing. Yeah, I just gotta get a switch in. We live that. <laughs> Uh, well, I mean, that's why you run Blizzard. So, it's fine, I guess. But, uh, Gigaton Hammer and Raging Bull target the bundle. Okay. And still frozen. It takes me down to Sash. Yeah, this one's over. Uh, this one was over on this freeze, and then the second freeze was just icing, uh, so to speak. Um, okay, so Tinkaton just has to unfreeze. Like, if that doesn't happen, I, get, I have nothing. But And it's, I don't know what, he has to like it double target the Tinkaton and not realize it or something. Um, this gets to come in, the Roar Veil's over at the end of this turn anyway, so I might as well close combat the Abomas now. Well, and unfreeze. No? Okay, rude. Yeah, so if I unfreeze, then the... Yeah, it was just booster speed anyway, so all my scarfing and all that, none of that mattered. Um, knockoff did, like, nothing. Um, yeah, wake up. Or unfreeze, whatever. Um, and the ice, the, that's even gone now. Um, so I am going to Terra Ice. And I think it's Rock Blast? Or is it? No, it's probably just Iron Head for reliability. Yeah, does nothing. Still frozen. Iron Head finishes off the Obama Snow. Um, hammer and uh, Headlong Rush is more damage. Yeah, Hydro Pump's not doing much either. Heat wave and it finishes that off. It does barely any, barely any of that. Of course, we're toxic again. Yeah, and then whatever the fourth mon is here, come yeah, Articuno finishes finishes things off. Uh, rock blast. Oh, hydro miss. And we live the freeze dry. Give me several hits. Give me three hits. Two hits. Ah, brutal. Um, okay, so the Terra Ice Torterra. Almost got it done. Uh, just versus a million special attackers. Who cares about the defense boost? Although Assault Blast is a great bring. Uh, it's a pretty slow Articuno, too, because this is not a fast... Uh... Oh, was it a... Oh, no, it went first. What am I talking about? Crazy. Um, all right, GG's. Dang. Alrighty, so we got that second one, and that's up as well. Okay, what did we learn? Yeah, maybe almost got there. Even. Um, so, yeah, if Tinkaton had gotten to 
do anything. I think that's a very different game. But, I mean, that's why you run blizzards, right? Spread 30% chance to freeze. You're, what, 49% to hit one in... Uh, what, as long as you don't care which one, right? Something like that. Um, well, still got to win to win win one of my last two then to get in for uh for playoffs but that was a good match like i mean bone making ice look good uh game one was just a stomping that was just not even close uh game two i think was i had a very good chance at winning in the world where this doesn't get frozen but Um, the Encore play was very nice. Booster speed, yeah. I mean, that's why you, that's why you take bundle, right? So, uh, anyway, I'm rambling at this point. Uh, we'll see you in a week for another one. Good luck to Bohm. I hope Bohm goes 5-0. and oh. And, uh... Alrighty. Peace.